WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a rainy Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we've got a sea of green out there, at least with regard to the U.S. indices, each of them trading to the upside. Dow right now up 185 points, about a half percent, a little over 1 percent for the S&P, or 62 points, 1 to 4 tenths for the NASDAQ, 264, nearly 3 percent for the Russell 2000. That's a 58-point move. Semis are up 2 and 7 tenths percent, 142 there, 1 and 3 quarters for the trannies are up 264, so we got a rally that's going on. Will it stick? You've had gold trading up 15 bucks, silver's up 74 cents, lights we crude up 28 pennies, natural gas is back 4 cents in a 30 year treasury. For now, 119.10, that's up uh, nearly one and a half points out there. Let's try to figure out what all this means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We'll begin with the ES Mini upper left hand side. No new profile form that we took a look at it yesterday and the day before. By day's end, they just simply vanished. So now there's no resistance that we've got at least out here. Profile resistance. We're trading at all time highs. There's an A to B equals CD pattern, an initial price projection, 56.10. That's especially a likely outcome as long as the spot volatility remains below its 50 day exponential moving average. At the present time, that 50 days at 13.55. If we take a look at the NQ, again, no resistance up above. New all-time high, likely going to go target that 2151 level. That's his A to B equals CD pattern to the upside. U.S. dollar index getting trashed, at least so far today. Big move. It's trading back into profile. It has support down at the 103.68 level. I would say the real support, though, is at the bottom of its weekly profile at 103.23. Gold having a nice move. Decent move out here, but it's uh, far from its uh, highs out there. The high today so far at 2358. We're trading at 2343. Now, there's a new profile that is attempting to form. Um, that uh, uh, profile. Uh, supports at 2314, resistance 2386. Now, this profile wraps around the prior profile. But like the ES and the NQ yesterday, I do not know whether it will stick. Uh, but if it does stick, it suggests we have a consolidation setting up. Inside of silver, it remains above the top of its daily profile out there. So it's still in a bullish uh, mode. Uh, Light speed crude, nice rally, trading above and closing above a couple of days ago, the top of its daily profile. But there is trend line resistance that it has run into. If we open up the chart, we can see we're trading in between trend line resistance and trend line support. If you can't bust them to the upside, perhaps what Lightspeed Crew will do is bust it to the downside. If you take a look at natural gas, natural gas yesterday basically hit that objective of 316. It really got to $3.15.9 out there. But there's a roads momentum indicator signal that was triggered out there. So if we did get a bearish reversal candle, that suggests a short term top. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Zed Show. If you're off to start your Wednesday, have a wonderful one. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon.